So many times I've found that people think that the world champions are somewhere else. The world champion in Brazilian Jiu-Jitsu comes from Brazil, right? We think we gotta go somewhere else to learn a skill or an activity that we want, that, that our passion is leading us to, and sometimes we don't realize it's right here in our hometown. So this is Tanner Rice. Tanner's 19, and he is the current reigning brown belt lightweight champion of the world. Well, the 
ages of your little brothers when they grow up and you get the taste of One is 15 and he is taller than me and he weighs more than me. If he's not fat at all, he's just a built little kid. Um, you know, he gives me a hard time and I, I think him, he, you know, he was there. Him and D2 were there the most helping me before the world's end. Uh, but he's getting close. Yeah, my 12 year old brother, he's about as tall as me too. And uh, they get both getting really good. You know, they're there all the time, especially in the summer. They're there the so. I do teach full time too. I've taught full time since I was 16. Um, I teach three classes a day. Um, we have a lot of kids. We have about 85 students at our school now. It's growing now since you know we. Uh, I won the world. My name's getting out there, and, uh, and we're getting a lot more students now. Um, so it does, you know, it pays for my living and expenses and pays for itself. The Gracie started jujitsu. They brought it from Japan and Brazil to America, and uh, they're the ones that started it all. And Gracie jujitsu consists of more of like self defense and like, the fighting part of it. Brazilian jujitsu is more the sport. Um, I started with Gracie jujitsu. I was taught by John Dilley and Randy Hutt. Um, they taught me more of the self-defense part of it, and I kind of got into the, the sport of it and started competing a lot, and I had to learn how to, to uh, kind of leave the, the self-defense part of it out for a little while and put the sport part of it in. Who do you think is that the person or persons involved in the mixed martial arts are the best jiu-jitsu uh, performers that are out there today? Um, you know, there's a lot. There's uh, Hajo Gracie, he does both self-defense and the sport. He has the most reigning world championships as now. He has 10 world championships. Um, you know, and Hicks and Gracie, that was my, my our John Doe's teacher. And um, he was very good. He's, he's a legend to this day. He's undefeated. He's never lost. And he's 52 years old. And he has never lost to this day. You mentioned it was eight minutes for the, for the whole fight? Right, um, yes. Is that divided into a series of rounds or is that continuous? That's continuous, eight wow. minutes. Yeah. Wow. Yeah. Did you win a big shiny belt? Um, I didn't win a belt. I won a medal and I got a lot of sponsorships from it and I uh, got my name out there. Yeah, parachutes. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> In the five fights you had this last year, how many were by point submission with? Uh, I beat the first two by submission and the last three were on uh, points. Which is points. Yes. <laughs> you have uh, uh, dieting that you go on? Uh, of course, yeah. I mean, I walk around about, about 177, so I have to lose about 10 pounds before I can beat. Are there any girls who do it? Yes, girls do it. There's a, uh, a lot of girls who do it now. If there wasn't a lot back then, um, but there is a very wide, uh, a very huge drawing to the, the women's part of uh, part of the sport. Is there a master's division too for older? Yeah, or actually, there, there is. There's master's division. There's seniors division. The senior goes all the way up to senior five, which is I think is 55, and you get all the way up there. Everybody comes. Like we have a lot of people. Believe it or not, it's kind of weird. Uh, we have a lot of people at our gym that they come in, and we have this one guy, uh, he came in at 51, and he started, and he's sticking with it, you know. He, yesterday, he broke his finger, and uh, he, he showed up again today and trained. I don't know, he's, I think there's something wrong with him. He's got a bash out there. Yeah. <laughs> his bash is going to be more than, than everybody else's. <laughs> I break everything playing tennis. <laughs> Thank you guys for the lunch and uh, thank you for the opportunity to come here and uh, I appreciate it and thank you for your time.